ISTQB Foundation Level Question 45. Which of the following options shows an example of test activities that contribute to success? A. Having testers involved during various software development lifecycle, SDLC activities will help to detect defects in work products. B. Testers try not to disturb the developers while coding so that the developers write better code. C. Testers collaborating with end users help to improve the quality of defect reports during component integration and system testing. D. Certified testers will design much better test cases than non-certified testers. Please press pause to choose your own answer before you see the correct answer on the screen. Correct answer is A. Having testers involved during various software development lifecycle, SDLC activities will have to detect defects in work products, according to ISTQB syllabus and common sense. It's important that testers are involved from the beginning of the software development lifecycle, SDLC. It will increase understanding of design decisions and will detect defects earlier. Main idea is testers should start your activity as soon as possible in SDLC. All the rest of the answers are wrong. Answer B is invalid because both developers and testers will have more understanding of each other's work products and how to test the code. But of course, testers should not distract developers from his work for no reason. Answer C is invalid because difficult to image that end users know about defect reports better than testers. Usually end users can participate in beta testing, but not at the component integration or system testing stages. Testers can work closely with system designers. It will give them insight as to how to test. Answer D is invalid because it's a strange statement. Testing will not be successful if legal requirements are not tested for compliance. For example, we may work closely with domain experts who may have extensive knowledge in their area, but lack testing skills and not be certified testers at all. Explanation. Let's look at the section 1.2.1 Testing's contributions to success in the ICQB syllabus, where we can see that testing provides a means of directly evaluating the quality of a test object at various stages in the SDLC. It means that testers take part in development process as soon as the basis for testing appears. The first requirements, the first documentations. At the first glance, this question is some difficult, but when you think about it, it's pretty logical and simple. Believe in yourself and your strength as I believe in you. Never give up.